Hello beautiful people. Welcome back to another video this holiday vlogmas season and I hope you guys are having a beautiful day. I know I am and it's beautiful outside and I hope you're having a beautiful day outside wherever you are. And of course, I have a spectacular video planned for you guys today. And as you can see, beautiful Christmas tree. If you haven't watched that video, that was my first video I posted. And I'll put the little uh, picture of me decorating the tree this year. This is our 2020 Christmas tree. And I hope you guys watch that video. That's, again, the first video I posted. But for today's video, I have something pretty cool I wanted to show you guys. So I have five holiday drinks um and they have holiday names to it and i just wanted to show you guys how i made those so in the video you'll see how i made these drinks and what i use like portions whatever but of course if you're doing a big like party and you have a lot of people of course you want to use more um of the sizes and portions and all that good stuff but check out this video so it's going to be again five holiday drinks that i put together and you'll see in each video how I put them together as well as what I used. So I will also put that in the description below so that you guys can follow along if you just look at the description after the video and you want to make it yourself. I'll put that in the description of each drink and what I used so that you guys can follow along at home, okay? I hope you guys enjoy the video. So here we go. Let's see the drinks. All right, so our first drink is going to be the Christmas punch and we have our orange juice and of course your cup ginger ale pineapple juice and cranberry juice and what I have here is a little small measuring cup and it's one fourth cup and then in the middle like in the inside it says one eighth cup um, so if you have something like this, definitely use it. So first what I'm going to do is I'm going to pour in the cranberry juice. And I'm going to get one fourth cup. You gotta be extra careful so that I don't spill anything because I don't want my mom to hurt me. And then now we're going to do the pineapple juice. Uh, we're gonna put that in and just put everything to the side when you're done with it and now we have our orange juice and same thing one fourth cup and you're gonna put that inside and again I will be putting like the ingredients and what I used and how much of it I used down below and in the description but of course, you know, you can just use um, however much you want to. But of course, with this cup, I just wanted to put a little bit so you guys can get an idea of what I did here. And of course, since this does fizz, I just did three of these. So one. Whoa. Two. And three. And again, like I said, I'm just putting the ingredients to the side and what I used. And there you have your Christmas punch. All right, so for our second drink, this is going to be your spiked eggnog. So you're going to pour whatever kind of eggnog you have into your mug, cup, whatever you have. And you're going to warm it up. I only put it on for like a minute and 30 seconds. You can go longer if you want it hot, hot, but I just did a minute and 30 seconds. And then I have um, Bacardi Peach Red. You can use whatever Bacardi you have. It doesn't matter what it is, but I'm just going to pour Bacardi all in there. And then I have this little straw. And I'm just going to use it as a stirrer and get it all in there. I can smell it already. 
If, if, of course, if you're not a Bacardi person, you don't have to use Bacardi. But um, that is what we had. So I uh, wanted to just use what we had. And then to make it, of course, Christmas style, I have ground cinnamon, signature brand. I'm just going to sprinkle that along. You don't want to use too much because, of course, it's just for like a decoration type of thing. And, of course, ground nutmeg. And same thing, you don't want to use too much of the nutmeg either. So I'm only going to do like a quick dab. And then, of course, we're not just going to leave it like that. So I'm going to, again, use my stirrer. And I'm just going to swivel it along. So it creates like a nice little design in the top. And there you have it. Your spiked eggnog. Enjoy. All right, so we have our cranberry mimosa, and this is a great holiday drink. First, you want to wet a little bit of your cup, and then you want to move it along the little, like, sanding sugar and get it a little bit on the rim here. And there you have it. It doesn't have to be, you know, perfect, fancy, just enough. Move that to the side. And, of course, we have, um, you can use sparkling cider or champagne. We have this brand of champagne our mark and i's best friends gave this to us so thank you guys dom and jared shout out to y'all and then you're gonna pour it in your cup whoa this is a lot with that one <laughs> so of course um you can pour it right over or you can tilt the cup a little bit but you just want to use you know halfway or so my mom taught me to tilt the cup. And then we're going to just use the rest of this cranberry juice. I'm going to pour it in there. And of course, if you have a spoon or something, you can stir it if you want. It's up to you. It's your personal preference. And then I have these uh, triple berry blend um, berries that I'm going to just put in our glass here to add some additional touch to this. And then there you have it, our cranberry mimosa. All right, so here is our next drink. And of course with the green, you're probably like, I already know what this is. This is your Grinch Punch. So we have Sprite, Hawaiian Punch, Green Berry Rush, and then we have some Sherbet. And of course, um, it's rainbow flavor because I need the green. So first what you want to do is get a spoon or um, a scoop, ice cream scoop, and of course have it a little already like melted so it just goes right in and get you two scoops and of course you can have this in a big bowl if you want to. It's like melted so much it won't want to come off. And um, you can have this in a big bowl for like a party and you can of course you know put much more but if you're just doing a cup like this you don't need that much and then next what we're gonna do is we're going to pour our sprite over top let it get the fizz there we go and then what you want to do is you want to put your juice over top and then what you want to let it do of course you'll see the fizz and everything you can get a spoon and you can kind of stir around so that the ice cream melts faster but of course um, it's up to you how you want to do it but like I said, you want to make sure that the ice cream is a little melted already so that it just can dissolve faster. But if it's something like this, it's totally fine. You can just get a spoon and stir it along so that it will dissolve right on. And voila, there we have it, your Grinch Punch.
All right, and here is our last holiday drink. It is Rudolph's Red Nose Punch. So we have Sprite and then our Fruit Juicy Red Hawaiian Punch. You can also use the Lemon Berry Squeeze Hawaiian Punch, but I wanted to do the um, Fruit Juicy Red, so you can use either one. But we have our cup, whichever style cup you want. And I'm gonna put the Sprite in first. And then you just pour in your juice. And just like that, there you have it. Rudolph Red Nose Punch. Rudolph's Red Nose Punch. And to top it off, you can put a cherry if you want to. Um, it's up to you, whichever you want to do. All right. All right, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed that video of me putting those five holiday drinks together. And of course, I did taste those and they are delicious. So I will not steer you guys wrong. Believe me, they are really good drinks. So I hope you guys try them out this holiday season for your holiday parties, get togethers or even just for yourself. And especially um, don't forget to have some hot cocoa at least once this holiday season. Um, I've already had like three um types of hot cocos like different times so definitely get yourself some hot cocoa as well but i hope you guys really enjoyed this video i enjoyed making it for you guys as well as tasting the drinks they were really delicious so i hope you guys try them out too i'll be back with more videos this holiday season don't forget to like comment share and subscribe also turn on that bell post notifications so that you guys receive a notification when i post a video next and i'll be back with more videos this holiday season Mwah. love you guys bye